Well, uh, welcome everybody. Uh, Bienvenue tout le monde. Uh, it's a pleasure for me today to introduce uh, our first signee in this recruiting class. Uh, uh, Vanier College over the years has uh, produced some outstanding teams and uh, a long list of outstanding athletes that have uh, gone on to participate at uh, Canadian schools and a good number at NC2A uh, institutions as well. Uh, for years, okay, until the arrival of Christoph Smith, uh, one of the frustrations was that um, you know, we would end up either playing against a number of these Vanier College grads, and uh, I kept tapping my finger and my foot saying, uh, at some point, that there has to be one that can uh, make it to Queens. Uh, as you know, uh, uh, you need to be an outstanding football player uh, to be here and to be recruited and uh, certainly be part of this program. Uh, but there is also another requirement is you need to be an outstanding student. So uh, Christoph is here. I'm pleased that Christoph is here. He broke the ice, uh, you know, for, for Vanier Cheetahs. And today uh, we're going to have our second uh, Vanier Cheetah uh, become a uh, Queens football player. And let me just tell you a little bit about him. He uh, uh, just missed. This will, he'll wince a little bit. on just missed a three-peat this year. Uh, Two previous years, they were provincial champions at the AAA CJEP level, and uh, this year, uh, you know, they were going for a third, I think, and that uh, didn't quite happen, but uh, it was an outstanding career. I might also say that he is, uh, I think, I'm pretty sure, the first graduate uh, from Collège Notre Dame, and uh, in Montreal circles, Collège Notre Dame is the premier high school football program on the island. But I am reminded, because uh, Fred, Kin Fred Kincaid is here from Quebec City, that there are, it's one of two outstanding uh, programs in the province. Uh, uh, both schools have produced many outstanding students and uh, many, many outstanding teams. So we're very pleased that, uh, to have um, uh, this player join us. So I think without further ado, let's uh, say, au nom de Université Queens, je voudrais souhaiter la bienvenue à notre secondaire, la première recrue de cette classe de recrutement. Il s'appelle Brendan Coffey. It's a, it's a very, very, very rewarding day for me today. Um, I mean, obviously, I'm the one today wearing the jersey. I'm the one who put uh, pen to paper today, but today is the, uh, the accumulation of the hard work of a lot of people who invested a lot of time, a lot of energy in me. Um, I, couldn't, I obviously couldn't be here today without my parents. I'd be remiss not to, to thank uh, my mom and dad for helping me through thick and thin. Um, you know, for my teammates, everybody who's, who's played with me in the past, uh, I've learned so much from my teammates. Football, of course, is, you know, it's, it's, it's in between the white lines that it happens, but there's so much more to it. Um, and now I'm, I'm really excited to, to take the next step with those people uh, at my back. And I'm excited to join uh, one of the biggest and the most storied programs in Canada in Queens football. Uh, I'm excited to, excited to get to know my new teammates. I'm really excited to, to create those bonds in camp and practice and everything that comes with it off the field as well. And uh, I've, uh, I have a lot of big objectives in coming here to Queens. Um, I'm not going to hide from them. I want to win Vanier Cups, emphasis on the plural. And uh, so I'm looking forward to get to work. Oh, we've been uh, we've been trailing him. This has been uh, this is the end of a long journey in the recruitment. Um, I would say that uh, we sent our special envoy Ryan Shane to come back a couple of years ago. We also have an attaché who's a member of our organization who lives in Cornwall, a former Quebec resident who high school teacher there by the name of Ralph Whiteman. This is a great day for Ralph too because uh, he assists us in the identification in, uh, of players in the Quebec region. I don't think there's any secret that um, with the strong programs that exist in Quebec today, it's very, very difficult to get a uh, blue chip player out of that region. So uh, it, was, uh, it wasn't just a five minute conversation and he was coming to Queens. There's, it's been well over a year uh, that we've been tracking him, uh, speaking to him. Uh, I think his mom and dad, uh, and, and he uh, paid a visit here to Queens in the month of June. Uh, I think the campus was a little bit more inviting in the month of June than it was today. So uh, I, I think that they, uh, they all had a very good feel uh, for both Kingston. And uh, Brendan's got uh, high academic goals also. 
Uh, he's not just looking at doing his undergraduate degree, he's looking at going to law school. Uh, both his mom and dad are lawyers themselves, uh, so uh, uh, they were well acquainted with the career path, and I think as a family, uh, they thought that Queens made a lot of sense. Uh, the fact that uh, Brendan is a competitive guy and an outstanding athlete and a football player, I think finding a place where he could marry all of those different spheres together, this is what I think Queens made perfect sense for him. So we're delighted to have him. Uh, he's an outstanding player. Uh, he happens to be coming into the program at a time when we're graduating some outstanding defensive personnel. So uh, his timing is impeccable. All right, we have some of the defensive teammates here, uh, you know, to welcome him and to talk to him, etc. cetera. So uh, it's, been a, it's been a great journey. And uh, it's not ending today. Uh, part of the recruitment ends today, but his journey is uh, starting today.